along with that if there is any underwriting commission up to 80% we call it as disallowed item what are the things you are supposed to minus anything which is other head income we are supposed to minus underwriting commission up to 80% you are supposed to take it as disallowed item can we calculate directly answer is no why because you have long term in this A warm welcome to one and all. This is your Adesh sir here, lecturing with the Ashram First Grade College, the Temple of Excellence. And now we are discussing your Income Tax Two, Unit Five, and Session Four. In this, we are discussing topic called Assessment of a Company. Yes. In the previous session, we worked out two problems on assessment of company, and those are the problems which are your question paper problems only. And today, what we are doing. This is also complete 15 mark question for your examination. Easiest one to understand. Your agenda is very simple. The problems you are supposed to do. Problem number six. The following is a profit and loss account of the Deccan Sugar Mills Limited of an Indian company for the assessment year 2020. Now. These are the information we have, like your trading account and P&L account. They have given now. As I told you, out of these information, see, there is a first slide and there is a next slide. Out of these information, there are few things are there we are supposed to consider as disallowed item. Which are those disallowed item? As I told you in the previous class, like anything like provisions, any reserves. depreciation with adjustment any taxes other than your gst excise duty vat other than these three all the taxes will come under disallowed like your your luxury tax income tax municipal tax all these comes under your disallowed item along with that if there is any underwriting commission up to 80% we call it as disallowed item then we have any personal expenses donations and bad debts will not come if there is anything adjustment we are supposed to consider these are the things you are supposed to consider as disallowed item i'll show you the answer again i'll come back to your question see stock quarters are let out in interest of business so it is related to what business only allowance of depreciation 25000 see depreciation we have adjustment then we are supposed to consider as a disallowed this has to be minus as per the statement we are supposed to be add contribution to recognized provident fund so rpf it will be 15000 actual bad debts during the year 10000 as per the statement add as per the adjustment minus Company paid advance tax of one lakh rupees. Compute the total taxable income of the company for the assessment year 2020-21. Also calculate tax liability. Your complete 15 mark problem will be like this. I'll go to your answer later. I'll come back to your question. See, computation of business income for the assessment year 2020-21. they have taken disallowed item rbd depreciation well tax underwriting commission bad debts proposed dividend donation to political party donation to pmdrf allowable expenses like interest on bank deposit long term dividend share premium interest refund allowable depreciation contribution to recognized fund and actual bad debts now i'll go back yes in this these are your question what you are supposed to do i gave you the complete chart complete list of disallowed item remember that opening stock part of your problem purchases part of your business salary is a part of your business then rbd yes you are supposed to take why we are supposed to take r stands for reserve all the reserves will come under disallowed advertisement no depreciation yes because we have adjustment on that sales tax part of your business if you want to sell your goods what you are supposed to pay sales tax 
director fees no well tax yes this paid on property now at present there is no well tax earlier it was there under reading commission up to 80% you are supposed to take it as disallowed item excise duty no it is a part of your business remember excise duty your vat gst all your selling purpose you are supposed to pay bad debts we have adjustment yes if you have adjustment you are supposed to take hope you are clear yes. so this has to go like this yes now once you are done with this what is the next one the next is staff welfare expenses part of your business general expense part office expenditure part of your business proposed proposed means what provisions reserves so we are supposed to consider donation to political party yes subscription to chamber of commerce no that is your business related custom duty no interest on debenture yes auditor fees no legal no donation to pa prime minister drought relief fund yes we are supposed to consider hope you got it yes now what are the things you are supposed to minus you will get it right side or credit side of your question now sales no closing stock no rent of stock waters they have given in the adjustment that is for business purpose interest on bank deposit yes discount no long term yes dividend yes share premium yes interest on government yes refund of income tax yes refund of sales tax no sales tax is part of your sales transfer fees no so these are the things you are supposed to add you are supposed to minus under assessment of company only thing you are supposed to remember is what are disallowed item what are other head income whatever problem we are discussing today you can keep it as a base why because 90% of the concept of assessment of company included in this problem so for your examination if you want to do revision please work out this problem as your revision now stuff everything is done now i'll go to your answer see net profit as per profit and loss account i'll go back to question what is your net profit 3 lakh start your problem with net profit so 3 lakh now add all the disallowed item add all the disallowed item now so it will be what rbd 15000 rbd depreciation yes 28 i'll show you in the question they have given say 15000 depreciation see they have given 28000 then what is the next wealth tax of 26500 you will get wealth tax 26500 under written commission we have 25 on that 80% yes then bad debt 7500 what was given in the question copy paste proposed dividend 116000 i'll show you proposed dividend they have given what is the proposed dividend 116000 next one is what donation to political party 10000 next proposed dividend over donation to political party donation to prime minister drought relief fund we have taken then these are the things we are supposed to be added hope you are clear yes now everything is taken we have not interest on debenture we have not considered we considered as business income itself now what are the things you are supposed to minus anything which is other head income we are supposed to minus which are those other head income i'll show you less interest on bank deposit we have taken long term dividend share premium interest on government security refund of income tax allowable depreciation these in the adjustment contribution to recognize staff provident fund actual bad debts these also in the adjustment so add everything see how much you will get if you add everything 1 like 80 2 like 20000 2 like 42 3 like 67 3 like 87 3 like 
and it will be 4 lakh 4 lakh 20,000, 4 lakh 35, 4 lakh 42, 500. Hope you are clear. Yes, 4 lakh 42, 500 is your answer. And your net profit is 3 lakh. Add 2 lakh 33,000. So 3 lakh plus 2 lakh 33,000, it will be how much? 5 lakh 33,000. 5 lakh 33, you got minus all your incomes incomes means other head incomes 4 lakh 42 so what is your answer your business income is 90500 now once you're done with your business income what is the next procedure total income what is total income remember five heads income from salary it is always nil only you will not get income from house property income from capital gain income from business or profession last one other source all the five you are supposed to add now income from salary nil house property it is not given nil where do you get all this information simple go back to your question everything on the right side credit side of your question you will get all this information now so nil nil income from business or profession just now you calculated 90500 see whatever you calculated 90500 we are supposed to take yes then capital gain 180000 given in the question income from other source like interest dividend interest on government security you know that under income from other source whatever things will come you know the least also horse race crossword puzzle lottery income interest received post office saving deposit casual income any minor income all comes under what income from other source like dividend also interest on bank deposit dividend on foreign taxable interest on government security so total income is 3,52,500 add everything you got 3,52,500 now in this have you made any donations any investment yes donation 50% donation to political party 100% I gave you four Indira Gandhi Rajiv Gandhi Nehru and Prime Minister Drought Relief Fund these four always comes under 50% donation so 10,000 into 50%, 5,000. Clear? How to remember this 50%? Indira Gandhi, Rajiv Gandhi, Jawaharlal Nehru, and Prime Minister Drought Relief Fund. These four comes under half depreciation. Whatever amount given, we take half. Other than that, political party and all, full depreciation, 10,000. So 352 minus 15, you got 337,500. This is called as total income your step number two step number two is completed we'll go to step three yes computation of tax payable for the assessment year 2020 and 2021 tax on total income what is your total income three lakh thirty seven five hundred can we calculate directly answer is no why because you have long term in this long term horse race your card game lottery these are casual income these are again i'll repeat long term horse race your lottery income and your casual income always separate calculation for these four the rest of the things slab of 30 percent remember tax on total income 3 lakh 37 in this long term you bifurcate 1 lakh 80 thousand into 20 percent 36 thousand hope you are clear Good. 337 out of that 1 lakh 80 is minus remaining is how much? 1 lakh 57 500 on that 30 percent. 47 total is 80 350. Hope you are clear. From the total income you bifurcate long term because long term belongs to 20 percent. Even though there are horse race crossword, don't bifurcate. Why? Because that is also 30 percent. 
this is also 30%. No need of bifurcation. Only long term in the assessment of company, only long term capital gain you are supposed to bifurcate. Why? Because it attracts 20% tax. Now, 82 add education says 3,330, total 85,680. Have you made any advanced tax arterials? Yes. What is the advanced tax you paid? I'll go back to adjustment. 1 lakh rupees already you paid tax. How much you are payable now? Only 85. You paid already 1 lakh more. And TDS also 4000. So your tax payable will be nil. Hope you are clear. Once you are done with the calculation of tax, you have to check is there any TDS? Is there any advanced tax? If there are any advanced tax or TDS, you are supposed to minus this much only your assessment of company. Take this problem as base. For every problem, you will get solution if you work out this one. So I'll go back to all your previous slide so that you can take screenshot. Your problem number six, question part, your question, question part, solution. Your solution part, your total income are tax payable. Yes, this is all about your today's session. Please work out this one. This is very important for your examination purpose. Thank you.